Fulton Wrestling Program is one based in timeless tradition. With eight state championship teams and five individual state champions in their history, the program has been at or near the top for much of its existence. However, the Red Raiders have not won a team state title since 1995, a drought the team plans on ending this season. Head coach Jeff Waldron heads into his second season at the helm of the program and has high aspirations for his wrestlers. As hard as we've trained, every year I expect nothing but greatness. Um, I think that we're a contender for a state title, but it all comes down to in those big dual meets with the state ranked teams, are you going to bring your A game that day? Are you going to have all your starters line up? Is everybody going to be healthy? You know, those little things have big consequences. The team has 11 seniors leading it, many of which had the same aspirations as Coach Waldron. This season I expect to go to states and win a state title with my team. Hopefully win a state title as far as the team. Uh, I hope to win states as a team in sections and it'll be. I expect us to be state champions. I mean, we've put in the work all summer. We've worked harder than any other wrestling team in the state. So. And we have way more talent than a lot of the wrestling teams in the state, so we should get there. This team expects nothing but greatness on the mat, but the sport of wrestling itself can teach so much more. As wrestling legend Dan Gable once said, once you've wrestled, everything else in life is easy. The sport of wrestling has the ability to teach lasting life lessons that can be taught nowhere else. Well, when I see kids uh, really buy into the sport and learn life lessons that they're going to use for the rest of their lives, um, means a lot to me. See a kid maybe didn't have a lot going for them and then they got into the sport of wrestling and ended up being successful in life. You know, it's, it's a, more, a lot more than the wins and losses. It's uh, teaching kids how hard work is going to pay off the rest of their life. Fulton got off to a 3-0 start to the 2015-16 campaign, a start that includes a victory over arch rival Baldensville over Thanksgiving weekend. If everything goes right, this team should be tough to stop come February. Good luck, boys.